Hello guys, this is Aditya Kumar and Rajan Goel and in this video we will be explaining you about microwave oven. Now let's see what a microwave oven is. It is basically in home plans used for cooking and reheating purposes and we will see in further slides also that it basically works on principle of microwave radiations. Before getting into the working of microwave oven, first let us look at some applications of microwave oven and microwaves. One of the main benefit of microwave oven is that it consumes very less amount of energy compared to cooking stove. Now getting on to what microwaves are. These are a form of electromagnetic waves with wavelength ranging from 1 mm to 1 meter. It is mainly used in wireless signal communications of signals of very large bandwidth. These waves are absorbed and converted into heat by water, fats and sugar molecules. These waves are not absorbed by plastic, glass and ceramics and reflected by metals. You should never put a metal inside oven as it may cause sparks and damage your oven. What a magnetron is? Magnetron is a vacuum tube used for generation of microwaves in oven. It mainly consists of three things, anode, cathode and a magnet. When the hot cathode emits electron, they start moving in a vacuum. Their path is mainly decided by magnetic and electric field present. So these electrons move in a circular path and they sweep past these opening cavities. Now these cavities resonate at a particular frequency which is required frequency microwave. So the generated microwaves by electron goes to the food chamber. Now let us see how microwave cooks food. As we saw, microwave use magnetron to generate EM waves, basically microwaves. Now these microwaves, these EM waves come to the food chamber through something called waveguide. The food sits on a turntable spinning slowly so that the food is cooked evenly. Now the waves get reflected from the reflecting metal walls and penetrate through this food and vibrate the atoms in the food so that the molecular friction generates heat and the food gets hotter and quite cooked. Water molecules in our food have a dipole moment as shown in figure. So our food is exposed to electromagnetic waves which emanate from tube. In electromagnetic wave, the direction of electric and magnetic field changes 2.45 billion times per second. So the dipole of water molecule tries to align with the electric field also rotates very fastly. We can see this change from figure. So because of molecular friction, heat is generated and our food becomes hot and get cooked. For our food to be cooked in microwave, we must have water in our food as water molecules have a frequency which is resonant with microwave frequency. Now we perform a very simple experiment in microwave oven to measure the frequency of microwaves. We put a plate full of cheese in the microwave upper chamber such that it does not rotate. When we take it out after some time, we see that cheese has not melted completely and evenly. Cheese was somewhat like shown in the picture where some of its portion melted completely and some was unheated. To understand this, let us first understand something about standing waves. Three dimensional behavior of wave is difficult to predict but principle can be seen with the 2D structure of wave. First figure shows anti nodes in the wave which have maximum energy and the second picture shows node which correspond to no energy region in the wave. The portion of food which is at node region does not get heated and the portion at anti node get heated maximum. So our food is cooked unevenly. Because of this region, turntable is used in microwave so that food is cooked evenly. Now we measure the distance between two nodes or two no heated region in cheese. This comes out to be 2.5 inches. So the wavelength of microwave from this experiment comes out to be 5 inches or 12.8 cm. Calculating frequency from this value of wavelength gives the frequency equal to 2.34 GHz as shown in the calculations. Microwave ovens are really very nice in some ways as they consume less power and very less time to cook food. But there are some health hazards associated with microwave ovens. One of the most harmful things with food cooked in microwave is that molecular structure can get changed. But for case of water, we are perfectly safe as even after molecular structure change, either H2 or O2 will be formed, which can evaporate easily. There may be the case that H2O2 is formed, but it is easily decomposed. Other harmful effects are listed here. Thank you guys for watching our video. Hope you like it.